Good evening. I'm going to do another deck because I was forced inside by the weather. Not really, but it was raining from the the porch is screened in, so rain comes through sometimes. This deck is called the Dreaming Way Tarot by Rome Choi. Wow. She's holding a tour and sitting on a crescent moon. Now, I guess the idea behind this deck is illustrated by Quan Shine. Sheena. I'm sorry. And the back's the Fool, and it's at U.S. Games, and it seems like a nice box. The problem with it is just not all of this will fit in there. It just doesn't, you cram it, and then you can't get it open again. Oh, well, that's not important. You could put it in a bag, right? So here is the uh, Fool card. And last time I forgot to show what it's like compared to the my standard which seems to have disappeared where'd you go there it is i'm a standard it seems to be something i'm encountering a lot more they're close to standard but not quite there i don't want to cover up my card of the year so that's the fool card you know it's close to the usual red something that ain't a feather I'm not sure what it is. That's foolish looking. There's what the backs look like. I kind of like the back. Huh. It does come with the little white book. I think I jumped ahead there. It's not, you know, not much there. As always. Oh, I'm sorry. It does have two extra cards. You know, the advertising bit about the author and about the artist. Quan. China? I don't know. I'm sorry. Rome Choi. Pretty sure about Choi, but not 100%. People can pronounce their name however they pronounce their name. But here's the, the Trumps, the Major Arcana. I'm noticing a very feminine scheme, and that's okay. Uh, maybe not the Hermit, unless she has a beard. Maybe not the Emperor. Mm, I'm not sure. Or the Hair of Font. I guess I'm wrong on that. Sorry. Wheel of Fortune, which is always good to see a spinning wheel. I'm not sure why I say that. I just enjoy seeing that. And then Death has a different sort of approach. I'm going to pick that up because, one, I want to look at it. Something about binding her waist like that. And just the look of her. Hmm. I don't know. Oh well, let's move along here. Oh, I couldn't get them all on this space that I'm using. I probably should have used a board, but I didn't feel like it. There's the devil, which appears to involve a straight jacket. That's different. The tower. Wow. That tower really got it bad. Star. Hmm. The moon. Hmm. The sun. Naked baby time. <laughs> Judgment. No people coming up. That's okay. The world. Hmm. That's kind of like me on the porch. Sitting in a chair, except I have a weird chair. Glasses and a book. And some plants. I do have that. Interesting. There's the swords. Hmm. Ouch. He's bleeding green. What was this called? The Dreamer's Way. Hmm. This was also in the thing where the Morgan Greer showed up. Uh, the person was trying to make some point that I lost in all the jibber-jabber. 
but they had the Morgan Greer, they had the Dreamer's Way, and they have one I'll get to, the Llewellyn's Classic Tarot, which on the box looks like it's the, you know, the Wizard of Oz, but I don't think it is. Yeah, there's the cups. Whoa, whoa, six of cups, my card for the year. But I'm not stopping for that reason. I'm stopping because he's juggling and balancing cups. One on his leg, three on his head. Wait, that don't add up. Four on his head. He's trying to give her, or she's trying to give her, a cup with flowers in it. None of the other cups have flowers. Now that's one interesting pair of shoes right there. Huh. I like the background. It looks like birch trees to me. I hold it up there so I can see it again later. Yes, I watch my own videos. <laughs> they don't make me sleepy. Because usually I have the TV on mute, which is silly. If you watch a documentary and you have the TV on mute, you're not really learning a lot now, are you? But then again, that's just a habit. Wands. The shoes again. That's interesting. Now that's over the top. How would you even keep those on? They're more like skis. This person obviously was focused on the foot. <laughs> My goodness. He did that, or he's known, a, or she, he, have known a lot of people with really big feet. Pentacles? Oh my goodness. Hmm. There's a clownish juggler thing going here with the pentacles. I'm not sure. I like where she's reading. It's a nice horse. That's a disturbing chair. Hmm. And that actually looked uncomfortable to sit like that. So this was the Dreaming, Dreaming Way Tarot, in case I mispronounced it before. I hold it up there. Dreaming Way Tarot. With that, I'll say peace.